Hello and welcome to Digital Logic Part 6. In this video, we'll be going over programmable logic and arrays. The AND array consists of a matrix or grid of logical AND dates to the right and logical possibility inputs for these gates at the top of the grid. These logical possibilities are connected to the AND dates by programmable links which are depicted as a line with two circles at either end to mark a connection. These programmable links can be changed or programmed to accommodate different combinations of logical inputs to the AND logic gates. The way you read an AND array is by looking to see where the programmable link is for both the AND date inputs. If it is connected to an input, then this is one of the values that we get inputted to the AND date. So in this example, for output x1, the A and B inputs are connected by a programmable link. Therefore, the output is A and B. For output x2, the A and not B are connected by programmable links. Therefore, the output is A and not B. And finally, for output x3, the not A and not B are connected by programmable links. Therefore, the output is not A and not B. Now let's draw an AND array that has the following outputs output x1 of not a and not b, and output x2 of a and b, and output of x3 of not a and b. So for x1, we will need to connect our programmable links to the inputs not a and not b. For x2, we will need to connect our inputs a and b by programmable links. And finally, for output x3, we will need to connect our programmable links to not A and B inputs. And that concludes this video. Hopefully I've earned a like, share, or subscription. If you enjoyed this video, you may enjoy one of these videos as well. Let me know how I'm doing in the comments down below. Thanks for watching.